से you through the glass don't know how much time has passed all i know is that it feels like forever but no one ever tells you forever feels like home sitting all alone inside your It's Whitlock versus Fitton, and as ever, Lakeside Darts fans are in good voice and dressed for the occasion. Wigs, hats, messages for those at home are at the ready. Busiest person that plays the glass collector. He's lost half a stone running around. It's day four of nine. And that must hurt. Bling Master George has blagged some decent seats. It's for a place in the quarterfinals. Simon Whitlock last year's runner up against Daryl Fitton. Who's going to win, Bob, and why? Well, I, I think Fitton and Whitlock are equal on their scoring power. There's not much in it, but I've got to go for Simon Whitlock because his finishing powers are more stronger, I think, than Fitton's. Similar reason is he uses all the dark, but he's a very, very good mathematician. And he works all his shots out in the 300s. What's he going to leave? He's a very, very dangerous guy to play against. We will see. Players are about to get introduced onto the stage. Over to Martin Fitzmorris. Are you ready? Ladies and gentlemen, let's play darts. Please welcome from Australia the Wizard of Oz, Simon. and Tony Green are in the commentary box. <laughs> yes, pandemonium out here. What a complete full house here. And we've got some talent coming up, believe me. And this game is no exception. Daryl Fitton of England against the runner-up last year, Simon Whitlock. This is going to be some match. It's going to be a corker. And whether you're a wizard or a dazzler, I think you're going to have plenty to cheer on what is always a special night. The first round completed. We're into the serious stuff now. 
two heavyweights of the darting game on this lakeside stage. And can Daryl Fitton produce his best stuff against a man who will never let you off the hook? That's the big question. Well, both three love winners in the first round. Mark Salmon fell away to Daryl Fitton and Mark Brelli of Scotland. Well, Simon Whitlock really put pain there. Though, like I said, they've had a run out in the first rounds, but now it's serious. Just going through the practice routine, six darts apiece, and then we'll be underway. It's the best of seven sets. We've moved up another two sets. The progress. So smiling already is Daryl Fitton, but the serious part will be coming up in a couple of darts time. Daryl Fitton, very purposeful darts player against the relentless Wizard of Oz. First set, first leg, it's Simon to throw first. Very best of order, please. Game on! Rob Butler gets us underway, and off we go. First start of the match. Sixty. They have met before, these two, on television. 14 months ago, we saw them in Bridlington in the quarterfinals of the World Masters. And Fitton on a 55. roll on his way to the runners-up spot. Brushed aside the Wizard three sets to nil. I don't think it'll be the same story tonight, Tony. I'll tell you what, guarantee there'll be nerves from both players for 57. a couple of legs till they settle into it. The Wizards are in. Yes, they're wandering about all over. One hundred and forty. So there we start. One hundred and forty. This is what I think might be the story of the game: is that both players will raise each other's game as well. Yeah, back well, to back 140s. Thing is, Bobby raised a point, and he, I think he's right on this one. Is that 125? Uh, if anything, it's maybe the doubling of Darrell. If you can put that together, then I think uh, you know it could be his night. 94. Good cover shot on treble 18 for Simon Whitlock. From here, you, you might just fancy Darrell Fitton to nick this against the throat. 55. Simon, you require 150. Well, we're going for three balls. His own way, variations of finishing. Left 112. 98. Darrell, you require 126. We'll be going for 19s as well. See, trouble 19 again. Oh, that's wrong, bed. If it had got the single, been going for the ball. But there you go. 94. Well, blue start. Simon, you're a the 52. Break in darts. Slender margins of victory or failure. Double 16. I think that's gone in the eight. Double 12. Oh, good yes, recovery. Yes, that's game shot on the first leg. Simon Whitlock. Whitlock holds on to Second his throw. Second leg is Daryl to throw first. Game off. I think an example of the nerves there with that second dart. Yeah, and like I say, he, even though he's going to be going, throwing at the ball, he has to have that opportunity. And 58. He neglected to do so. He can't afford a loose dart. But they know that better than I do. 100. Great crowd, though, David. Yeah. Full house again. I'll settle down, giving the best of order. 140! To be sat behind him, would you? <laughs> you don't see anything. 121! And there are some great views to be had at this hall, this arena. 
Coliseum of the Tungsten Gladiators. 97. Thought I was going to get a check then. <laughs> referee Rab Butler, spot on. 135. 60 this year. He's counted every one of those years. Is that a bus pass? It may well be. 140 one for Fitton. Simon in a car, 145. Trouble 20 to leave 85. Well, 70 scored and went down for treble 17. So Daryl, you require as much pressure 66. on the throw as he could. Fitton should go treble 10. Double 18. Single 10 leaves single 16 for double top. Now, how are these doubles, Daryl? 46. Not so good. Simon, you require 58. Not a good chance here. Single 18. Double top. Double 10. Yes. Yes, as game shot on the second leg. Simon Whitlock. Well, break a throw. Third leg, it's Simon to throw first. Game on. That's the point, David. Can't have missed the finishes. All right. Both of these players will jump on the other one's back the minute there's the merest hint of a slip up. 96. But he means business this year, does Simon Whitlock, after coming so close in 2008, runner up to Mark Webster. I've had an Australian win the title, Tony David. Back in 2002, remember it well. It's a maximum, it is. 180! Up the go. Some of the Arlequin lads in there. Oh, that looked to me like Tani Fuga. Yeah, the really Samoan good. International who's here with us this evening. 95! Not some New Zealanders, but no summer ones. There he is. Here's Tanny and Nick Easter. Minty, back here again. 140. Yeah, England International put a leg with Bobby last year. So that was one of the most nerve-wracking things he's ever done. 127. Oh, we've had plenty of Simon celebrities, haven't we? 85. Royalty as well, seeing darts like this and looking at double top. Clinical. Yes, that's game shot on the first set. Simon Whitlock. Never missed a finish in that set. Certainly didn't, and that was a 12 dart leg to wrap Second it up. Second set, first leg, it's Daryl to throw first. Game on. Daryl has to wake up now. Not handling the Aussie. 99. And he only really had one chance, didn't he, for a double Daryl Fitton in that first set. Despite keeping pace on the scoring overall, would Daryl Fitton find himself brushed aside three legs to nil? But he Look at the uh, averages there, David. Well, I was going to say, yeah, there's only three points difference on the averages. 100 plays 97, but Whitlock 112 from the outset. That's good power scoring before he gets to the doubles. What Fitton's got to remember, though, is that Simon Whitlock had the first throw in the first set, so... Darrell, with that opportunity now, has every chance to make amends. I just uh, missed the one double. One Here we go, another one. They're up the standing. Yes, and number one. <laughs> Up and down. And is this another one coming up? Could be, you know, he might just fill it up. 140. Daryl, you require 141. Well, he's got to get it, you think. We'll see. Yes, treble. 81 left, treble 15. Double 18. You've got to it, these, Daryl. 
Oh, 105. Simon Uruguay, 81. Another chance for Whitlock. It was wayward from the Dazzler. Single 19. And they'll now go 12 or treble 12. It's bullseye. This would really hurt. 51. And he missed the ball by the same margin Canada that Fitton missed double 18. 36. Fitton gets a chance, though, to make amends and to take the leg. Double 18. Great marker. Can't believe that second arc didn't go in there. But the third yes, dip. Yes, that's game shot on the first leg. Daryl Fitton. Well, that's a bit of relief for second Fitton. Second leg is and for Crystal, his uh, girlfriend. Game on. Flies through the air with the greatest of ease. 43. Good chance now. Take command of this leg. But uh, not accepting it. 119. Comes them cover shots. And what other players could learn from that? Talking to Martin Atkins. 99. And he could have done with that switching a few times in his win last night, where he left himself on, on bogey numbers in the 160s. He said, I just wasn't counting, probably not looking at the scoreboard. So I can't believe I did it. 100. Yeah, it's surprising how it gets a grip of you on that stage. 59. So many things to contend with, David, haven't they? I think. It's different than playing an open tournament on the floor. Not only the crowd watching, both on television and here in the uh, hall. 60! Also the lights shining brightly down from on high and it gets very hot under those lights for the players. As you go 140 to win, you don't want to be letting the side down. You've got all your fans shouting for you. And the hand that rules the dart. 94. And there you see Daryl Fitton Simon doing his counting. Treble 18 or a single would have left him on a finish, but Whitlock wants 160. Nope. He did two treble 20s. Hasn't got either so far. 60. Daryl, you require 128. Trouble 18. Trouble 20 will leave the ball. Ball. Oh, no. 79. Didn't like it. Simon, no, you require 100. So Whitlock, trouble 20, double top. Now, will he go two double tops here? Now, looking for the treble and double 10. Either way, Fitton will return. 60. To give himself a cushion 49. in the second set. Options here. Nine leaves double top. That's his favourite finish, double top. Yes, that's game shot on the second leg. Daryl Fitton. That proves the point. Third leg is Daryl to throw first. Game on. We'll be happy with that, certainly. Checked himself, made it count. Well, we looked at the first set, we love. 137. And on the same path. Made the company. Yeah, the, the scoring is not dissimilar from either player. 93. Some great shot there of how Simon Whitlock's hand goes from sort of clenched to fully extended after the darts have left it. As far as his overall average in this match. 84. Yeah, and Whitlock, no answer to it in this particular leg. Look at that. Over 100 for Daryl Fitton, 96 for Whitlock. 140. But Fitton started to boss the first nine as well. Yeah, what a leg. 137, 180, 140, 44 left after nine darts.
in command. 58. Darrell, you require 44. Well, we know he likes double top. We need four to go for it. Double top. That's the set. Yes, that's game shot on the second set. Darrell Fisher. Sweet as a nut. Just superb. Splendid. Dazzling darts. Third set, first leg. It's Simon to throw first. Game on. 11 dart leg to wrap up the set, and the Dazzler's back in business. Martin Adams 41. leads the parade on the quickest leg. 10 dart finish. He does. We've had uh, some near misses on the nine darters so far. A few guys getting five in a row. 100. Tony O'Shea getting six travel 20s in a row. He's done it a few times, actually, Tony. Never just reached the limit. 140. Not in this championship, no. Got a nine darter in uh, Holland in the IDL a couple of uh, years ago. Won a car. I think the same year that Phil Taylor, I think, got yeah, a nine darter in that tournament as well. Yeah, he got a car as well. 60. In terms of nine dart legs in this championship, Paul Lim, the only man 40. still to do it. Yeah, it was his lucky day that day. He beat me at golf in the morning. Could have been playing for money then. Well, uh, but I owe him it still. <laughs> One hundred. So said steadier stuff at the start of this third set. As we watch these twenty-two gram nickel tungsten harrows darts from the side. Eighty-five. Whitlock plays with the same weight, 22 grams as well. Puma yeah, dance. Popular weight, uh, 22 grams. 85. Doesn't look, look, look like copper tungsten as uh, Whitlock's. 98. Oh, that's right, touching that's the touching. ball, that 98. counts. That's a handy. A little deflection. No, bullseye first. This checkout's on here. Double 16. Brilliant. Yeah, 95 that's that's checkout from Whitlock. Simon Whitlock. Second leg is Darrell to throw first. Game on. Well, the first set was three love to Whitlock. Second three love to Darrell. And I wonder if uh, it's going to be three. No. 81. All the way down. Mm -hmm. Strange. All going with the throw in terms of sets so far. 100. Just one slip. 43. That could be it. Marjolina. Marjolina Hus. I'm a super Dutch fan. Disability with a hearing since birth and uh, 57. Big fan of Wolfie. And uh, Ray Stubbs. But more importantly, she's a huge fan of the darts and is here for every session, every year. And not just at the lakeside. See her in Holland. See her at uh, the Masters as well. 100! I do believe she travels everywhere on the run. Fantastic, isn't it? No reason not to. 100. So Fitton just lagging a little behind, but not by too much. Well, he's got him sold back into this leg. But that's well, not going to help, is it? Up to that foot down, yeah. Look, look at the wire where it bent in. 40. Absolutely. Shuddered the metal. Watch this. Bang. Push the wire further into the sizer. 100. Yes, made the target a bit smaller, I think, as well. But more importantly, Simon Whitlock. Long way ahead here. 59. Not down to Simon a finish, so. 144. Six starts for it. 
So, another one. Just giving it a thought, maybe 12s. No, I went for the treble 20. That's 132. Fine. Wanted to leave double six. David said, no out shot on him. No, but that's good pressure. 134. Not that Whitlock require 12. suffers from pressure. Imperious to it most of the time. Yeah, there you go. Yes, that's going to land the second leg. Simon Whitlock. Third leg is Simon to throw first. Game on. He's the most focused dart player out there, Simon Whitlock. Eyes never wander, do they, from the target? Yeah. 59. Andrew, the Aussie cr cricket team aren't uh, doing that well now, are they? South Africa beat them in the test, noticed. Absolutely. Maybe darts can become their new sport down under. 97. Well, they might be under pressure, ponting, you never know. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, if ever they gave out gold medals for staring competitions, 96. Whitlock and have an absolute haul. So intense. Far more relaxed is uh, Darrell. Natural player. Can slip out the hand. 140! Just did well. Both of these players comfortable with the pace of the game. They're playing their own pace. This evening. Very steady, very methodical. But it's producing some splendid darts. One hundred and forty. Yeah, Sam has been over here for about three months now, taking in all the tournaments and settling in. He left the wife and family at home this year. One hundred and eighty. It looks like it's paying off. Darrell, you require one hundred and twenty-four. Ever since the Grand Slam, now Darrell Fitton wants bullseye for a one-two-four. That yes, time he got the bullseye. On the third leg. And he's not going to be brushed aside in this set. Fourth leg is Darrell to throw first. Game on. There it is, a set saver. He now has to win this leg with the darts. 140. Going the right way about it. That's his seventh 140 of this match so far. We knew that he'd be tested more than the first round. Look at the sun table. 20 100 pluses we've had from both players. 12 140 pluses and five 180s. And we're in this third set. And here's another 180 coming up. No. <laughs> Couldn't talk it in. He tried. He didn't hear you. <laughs> but he's all ears. 58. Pretty good start, though. In this. Uh, in this leg, he has to win it, does Darrell? 55. Look how they're throwing the final leg. There's the men in black. Well, we'll already be thinking about that final leg as well. He's just maybe going through the motions here and stealing himself for one big effort to come. The jesters. They're not the Harlequin, then. They're not the Harley Quinns. <laughs> so, 51 left. He's dropping down for 139. single 19. So, 32. 83. To save the Darryl set. require 32. Daryl Fitton. 1 to go. We look right down the no score. all in the same place, but they'll be coming back. Interesting that he, he went 19 for double 16, Daryl Fitton, rather than the 11 after the treble 20 to leave double top. His favourite double top is abandoned, but he's still 32. got time, as you say. Yeah, 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 Maybe so he just wanted some practice the on the double 16. Daryl Fitton. He says the best on the ball. It's Simon to throw first. Game on. As I always say, it is when you hit it. It's a good double, though, you see, from 16s you go to 8s to 4s to 2s to 1s. 59! So, 
And that's why we put a camera right by it to give you a perfect shot. So. 16. And there is the camera, just obscured by Daryl Fit. A little Cyclops in the corner to give you a perfect view of the throw for a double. 114. Under a little pressure now to take 100. the sense of the same that lock favourite. Oh, yes, his own ideas of going round the board, maybe all the lot. Yes, he has done as well. But he's left him 140. He's counted that out, he's thought about it, and he's left himself a, a tiny little 140. Caught rub out uh, there a little bit, didn't it? Yeah, but that 14 staying on the 20, you see, it's, it's well worth it. 140. For the set. Well, the set state for Fertman is 281. You can't do anything about this. It's, uh, Simon in the background, bouncing up and down. That will help. The pressure could be on. But he's doing it from a long way back. Double top for Whitlock. And another set in the bag. And the third set. Simon Whitlock. And you know what? That meant a huge amount to Simon Whitlock. You can tell. I suppose you could say a sigh of relief. What? Another set goes. With the player throwing first. And then about a sigh, I think the fist of triumph. One hundred. Just the throw in it really, you know, that's had that advantage. Certainly uh, Daryl's going to have to make it count in this one. One hundred. Danger mouse. Enough, it's, uh, it's now best of seven sets. Which is good. 100. Because both players get full opportunity to show what they can do. And they're both in this one for the long haul. They're both expecting a really tough encounter, and that's what they're giving each other. Fitton here is the number five seed. Whitlock here is the number 12 seed from Australia, back by rights, of course, as runner-up last year. Always a very dangerous man outside the uh, the top eight because he he doesn't go to as many tournaments to gain his ranking points as some of the other players. Spends his uh, summers, well, from a UK perspective, mainly down under. Oh, by the way, I counted up today's on 24 tournaments. In Asia 100. and Australasia, four times the Australian Masters, four times their Grand Masters. He's won. He's prolific down there, Tony. He certainly is, and uh, he isn't too bad over here either. Very well respected. 134. Great to come, with. Some uh, Nordic warriors watching a raider from down under. 105. Nice finish here. Carol, you require 124. Trouble 20. Yeah, 64 left. Trouble 14. He'll be going for the ball. He's already hit it once. Oh, just a fraction. 99. But it's let him in. Simon, let you require in. 96. Already taken out 95. What about 96? Trouble 20. Would leave double eight from here. Above and below. 56. And Fitton, well, Darryl, you he's got a chance 25. here, two darts at a double. But no, it's only one dart at a double. And it's double four. Big, big dart for him, this. 21. Straight away from his double top. Simon, you require 40. And that's what the wizard wants. Double top. Yes, that's game shot on the first leg. Simon Whitlock. Absolutely. Second brilliant. leg, it's Simon to throw first. Game on. He's checking out 
all the time, isn't he? Well, he is. He's leaving himself tidy finishes. And he's making the most of it. And I say that's a big, big leg. Look at these checkout percentages. 58% for Whitlock, 7 out of 12. Darrell Fitton, 5 out of 15 for a 33%. And he's got to up that to get back into this match because that leg from Whitlock against the throw there. The set that Darrell Fitton had the advantage of first throw. 134. Well, when he was looking pretty handy, out comes Whitlock with a 134. Started this one with a 140. 85. Leans forward so he can almost touch the board, you feel. 60. Only 60, though. Right at the centre of the ball, so it first to the hockey. Relaxed set. Very relaxed style. Pays off, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, throws with no effort. <laughs> He's back. <laughs> it's rodeo time. <laughs> 98. Yeah, I'm going to tell you, I'm like here in the dark side pony, are they? <laughs> Fitton wants treble 20, well, treble 19 now, we'll leave double 18. Great recovery, double 18 to finish it off. Yes! Yes, that's game shot. And the second leg, Daryl Fitton. That was brilliant. And they know it. Third leg is Dazzling. to throw first. Game on. Regains the throw with a 12 dart leg. And the first emotion coming through. Darrell Fitton, and off we go. He knows the importance of this particular leg. 135. Groans and oohs and ahs from the crowd. Darrell Fitton just misses out on a maximum. 16. I think they like jumping up, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Can he actually see the darts through that? Oh, just. Yes. Santa does bling, I think. 16. Mark is there. 16. There was a lot of expectation, I think, about this match. And the pace that it's being played means the crowd can keep up with it. It's not happening too fast. And everything's 96. on a knife edge. Tension in the air. 16. Well, as the points slip by, Darrell should take command. 174. Well worked out. Whitlock finally discovers his travel to it. He's a bit too late. Darrell, you require 36. Two on. Double 18. Yes. Yes, that's going to shut on the third leg. Darrell Fitton. 13 dot finish for Fitton. Fourth leg, it's Simon to throw first. Game on. Whitlock throwing to save 100. this set. There's another. Dazzling double goes in. You say the scoring from Whitlock just dropping a little bit. Fit and well in charge in terms of the averages. And that's an indication 16. from Whitlock there. 93 for the first nine, 92 overall. His doubles are still brilliant, but he's not getting the big scores at the start of the leg. This could be different, though. It is. 180. It's up there. Unlucky. Well, that one made it four apiece in 180s, the maximums. There it is. Ninety-one. Yeah, doing well. 
And the leg is started first. On to 130. After nine darts. So, 12 dart finish, possibly. But have we got another 180? Yes, we have! We certainly have! Simon, you require 130. All right, Whitlock, treble 20. And then we'll see where he goes. Def definitely needs a treble 20. Would have left the bullseye. It'll come back. 65. But Witten can get a lot closer now, can't he, to the double? Yeah, it'll only uh, increase the pressure that they're under. Can get that treble 20, yes. 100. So it's 25. Simon, require 65. 25. So seven. Double, double 16 left. 49. Just speed it up a bit, didn't Don't he? Only require 80. Towards the end there. Don't think that helps him. Single 20 for Daryl Fitton now. Has to be careful of the angle of the dart and needs to move to the left a bit because he's blocked the bed. One at tops. And 16. There, clipped the dart, dragged it underneath. Simon, you require 16. With three darts. Double eight. Yes, that's game shot on the fourth leg. Simon Whitlock. All he needed the one. Fifth leg is Daryl to throw first. <laughs> game on. Sparkling darts, sparkling shades. And we're going all the way in this fourth set here. Fenton starting first. Win this. 100. We're back to all square again. Well, that's what we've had throughout. One throwing first. He's taken the set. Wins the scoreline 2 1. 95. They're putting a lot of effort into this one with Darrell. He knows the importance. Take a picture. And what a picture. And what a sight this looks. And at that oh, moment, no, no, come no, 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 on. He's still got it all to do as Darrell. Yeah. Don't close the lens. He's focused, and so are these two. Fitton and Whitlock. Brilliant. 140. We look forward to this. We knew it was expected, but it's happening. So 81 for Daryl Fitton then, this for the set. Single 16 leaves his favourite double top. It's double top for Fitton for 2-2. Two -two. Yes! Yes, that's game shot. And the fourth set, Daryl Fitton. Oh, what is going through that man's mind? What's going through his Simon mind? To throw first. Who doesn't mind? Double top for the muscle that is Daryl Fitton. Yes, he knew. 59. He knew there he had to hit that. He couldn't go 3-1 down, but here we are, all level after four sets. Twelve darts. Thirteen darts. 134. Eleven darts. One eighties. They're giving us everything. A side view. I tell you what, with all due respect 57. to the efforts of Mark Salmon and Mark Barilli, who didn't test either of these two really in the first round, this has more than made up for it. Pushing each other on. They know they have to be 59. giving 150% up there, because 100% just won't do tonight. Oh, the atmosphere is there, the heat's there, it's all on. 140! It's a good one, the first one. Because now he's got more room for 18s, it'll be. There 138! We well, went for the 18 with his last start. Yeah, to leave 170. Guaranteed finish. Oh, yes! Can you require 170? They've paid for the seats, they've hardly sat down. 100. 
having to produce another 180 to get himself down to the 65. Oh, it's going to be three or seven. Seven it is for double four. Wow. 61. Costly, costly, costly. He hasn't missed many. Crystal looking on. Staring out. Double 18. All right, good marker. Yes, yes he didn't that's need to be. All he needed to throw. Goes ahead in the match. Second leg is Darrell to throw first. Game on. I just wonder if there's not a little bit of momentum going Fitton's way here. Well, he's broken serves already. Flexing Love his muscle, wizard. isn't he? Ninety-five. That, uh, that would help. What he was looking for. Could be catching now. Maybe just getting through to uh, seventy-five. Four sets of magic. 45. Look at those doubles checkouts. Huh? And the wizard has helped. 53% on his doubles. 100. him so many times, you know, his uh, favourite to win this title. 140! Yeah, he, he often puts up displays that just can't string it together for a whole tournament. Did, obviously, at the World Masters the year before last, where he got to the final. At this stage last year, he beat 100. Gary Robson 4-0, Darrell Fitton. Super average that night. Demolished, yeah. didn't he, Robson? Then, as Whitlock goes down for the 25, but then couldn't put it together Darryl in the quarter-final against Webster. Big out shot here. Trouble 17. He'll shake the roof if it goes in because he's going for the ball. Oh, no, 136. A smile comes Simon to his face. He's got the whole world on his head. This man's got it on his shoulders. Doubles at 16. No, double eight. And he was oh, so yeah. far off, he might as well have been on a different planet there, Simon Whitlock. Now you require 25. Okay. The world could be yours. Double eight. Doesn't like this side of the board. Prefers double top, but he wants double eight. One dart to go. But he gets yes, it! Yes, that's game shot on the second leg. Fifth set. Third leg, it's Simon to first. Game on. The nutty boys going nutty. Three legs on the trot now for Daryl Fitton. Whitlock, for the first time really in the match, under some severe pressure here. It's been nip and tuck, but it's just ebbing Fitton's way. Yeah, it's just drifting away from uh, Simon. Just a wee bit. Still the best of seven. 135. Get on your bike, he said. He needs some of these. He needs all of these. 180. Crowd almost on their knees. 13 180s in the match we've had. 100. And there's the latest. There might be a 14th coming up. 140. We'll settle for a 12th 140 instead. Is that a turn 180, 140, Simon? Is 81 left after nine? Just hang on. 177. Plus pressure on Whitlock. Simon, you require 81. He needs 81. Has to get it, double 12. 
Yes! yes oh, it's it's brilliant. Brilliant. The third leg. 11 down so finish. Well. Had to do third it as well. Is Darryl to throw first. And Darrell's already underway. Yep, he's keen. And he's got the darts in his hand to start, and he wants to pile on the pressure. And Whoa! he's doing so! Oh dear. This great. It's all happening here. 100. Well, 180s with magical, monotonous regularity. Ninety-six. We all bring out one special match a year in the early rounds. This is certainly living up to that. Ninety-seven. But the thing is, Daryl Fitton can win this leg. He's a set-up for the first time in the match. Eighty-five. That's the right time to take it. Oh, good cover shot. Good cover shot. He went for the 170. So he has a three dart shot if. Uh, well, he won't get it now, Harold. Single 20, he'll have his favourite double to come back to. 81. Yeah. Wasted a dart. Here we go. No, not to be. We'll go for trouble 19 again, though. 96. Sticking down there. And that's Darryl exactly where Fitton's heading here, but single 19 to leave him double top. It gets the single 19. Now wants double top. One more for the set this. For the set yes, goes it's Darryl game Fitton. Shot. And the fifth set, Darryl Fitton. He's taking his game to new levels here. This is fabulous Fitton at the lakeside. Six set first leg is Darryl to throw first. Game on. He's having his finishes, that's the main. Is it in the finish? Something he's neglected to do throughout the world championships he's taken part in. 60. Still at averaging 100 overall in this match. Seven 180s each. There you are, the 100 83. average for fit and 96 average for Whitlock. Just under. 106 for the first nine, 98 for Whitlock for the first nine. And we're at the start of the sixth set. So many big scores. Look at these. 20 tons, 20 tons to 43. Whitlock, 28 to Fitton, 12 140s, 11 140s Fitton, and 7 180s apiece. And that's the key, though, isn't it? 44. Still Whitlock on his checkouts, 50%, but Fitton raising it now, 42%. That's 11 out of 26. And as you say, Tony, that's where he's gone wrong in the past. Yeah, he's pulled his socks up, certainly. In this match, long. 50. So the scoreline, 3-2 in sets to Fitton. He needs one more set to go into the quarterfinals. Whitlock's got to break it somehow. 43. Only a fraction away. What a difference. 57 points. Cover shots is hitting. 96. Forging ahead. No finish. 162. But Whitlock won't be down to a finish either now. 140. Close, but no cigar. 80 scored. Can we go for the ball. No, he's going to stay up there for the 140. Yeah, well, why not? He fancies his chances at double 11, does he? He <laughs> could always change it, but. Uh, 79. It's good. It's Darren good when you've got options. 22. This is options, but it's double 11. Oh, he does yes, like it. He knew what he was doing. Darren Fitton. Second no leg stopping is Simon to throw first. Game on. I think it's getting through to Simon. Really is now. Precious telling. 
59. Well, it's dawned on him that he's in a spot of bother. I think in that last set, I just felt that he was feeling the tension. Thoroughly likeable man, Simon Whitlock. Thoroughly 16. good darts player who I hope will shine on this lakeside stage for many years to come. Runner up last year. Pushed Phil Taylor all the way at Wolverhampton a few months ago. 5 1 up against the power at one stage. Yeah, we've had some uh, great guys over from Australia. Terry O'Day comes to mind. Tony David, obviously, the only Australian having won. 140. This title. Russell Stewart. Ninety-six. So still going now with it. <laughs> she's feeling the heat. Oh dear. Is Crystal? <laughs> yeah. I wonder if she's looked into the ball. Is number one fan, and she needs a fan of her own, I think. Fifty-eight. Touching wood. She's almost smashing the table. Falling short now. Good cover. Ninety-six. Still not got away from Darrell. Mark is good. One hundred. Finish of hundred and forty-three. Yeah, look like on one nine two. His cover shots are still there, though. He's he's not out of this. It's only the slenderest of margins, but Darryl more McCall, momentum that's keeping fit in the head. Can he get a 1-4-3? Not now. Takes off the 43. Simon require 58. Single 18. Double top. Double 19. 39. Well... I Darryl just said, I think the nerves are getting through. This will be a good out here. Look at the smile. Treble 20. Double top. Just a fraction below. No! 60. He can't believe it. I can't believe it. The winning post Simon is nearly there. 19. That's the trouble. Still won't know who's going to... That's it, but double A to help. Yes, that's game to on the second leg. Simon and a smattering of applause there. Third I think the crowd signing with Fenton here. Game on. Still, the, still Darren's darts. Fifty-nine. So one apiece, remember, Fitton needs just one set. Just 60. two legs, and this set will do. 50. Is this another? Yes, another maximum! Up the goal! And this is the show. He's on the button on the red bits, isn't he? 100. Good sight. 94. Agonizingly, this is where we have to leave it. It's that red button time again. And while the players keep trying to hit the red bit of the treble 20 via the red button 94. of the TV remote, you can see the rest of this match. Highlights tonight's four matches at 20 past 11. The live darts via the red button. For him. 134. That helps. Here we go. Barry require 108. Double 20. Single eight or 16 will do. 
He wants double 16. Oh, he preferred double top, I think. Sign only require 112. This man will take this finish however it comes. And it will need to come treble 20 for double 16. But it's not going to come. He steps back. Whatever he throws here. Daryl Fitton's got three in his hands for double eight. Daryl, you require 16. Nice to see a couple of legs ago on double eight. He wants it now to put him one leg away from the match. He's done it yes, as well. Yes, that's game shot on the third leg. Daryl Fitton. Well, well there we have Simon it. Simon to throw first. Fighting now is the Aussie to stay in this year's World Championship. Last year's runner-up is in trouble. I think he is. And he's known it for a while. He's got to find a way to break the fit and throw. 16. Good chance now. Two points ahead plus these. 100. Speed it up his dance. Sure, Daryl Fitton will, though. The momentum of the match is going with him. He's comfortable at this pace. 45. And maybe he might just switch off a little bit in this leg and think about the next one, Sony. I was just going to say, because he's got that cushion that he knows that the next one, he has the first three darts. And the 99. times Eric Bristow used to use this ploy. To stays off and then think, right, I just need to go the next one. 45. Simon, you require 122. So, treble 18 leaves the bullseye. Doesn't have to go for the bullseye, but... Just hang around on the 18s, he does. 54, 54 scored. Mind you, 180. 125. Simon, you require 68. Trouble 20. Double four. 60. Well, it's maybe not uh, at this time that he's not rude, but we're getting through to him that he's not finishing his doubles off straight away. No, he's not. And Darrell is now down to a finish, and he's Simon below 100 too, but eight. double four for Whitlock. There you go, yes, he can get it, you know. Fourth leg. Son of Whitlock. This is the one. Fifth leg is Darrell to throw first. Game on. The crucial part of the match as far as Ditton Fitton's concerned. And the crowd know it as well, you can hear a roar coming up as Fitton takes to the hockey. And he produces a 140 to start the leg. He'll be saying to himself, this is it, just this one. And Whitlock will be hoping Whoa, for another treble 20. He didn't get it. So fit and 40 ahead. In he goes. Yes. Is it another? Yes! Almost oh, put it in a leg of his life. 140, 180. We said, David, this was the leg, didn't we? We did. And has he broken the Wizards back early in it? He's still got to hit that magical winning double. Yes, but he's really heading for it. Look at that, 358. 100. She's almost crying. 81. Well, she knows it's very nearly there. 81 points away. Could finish it in two darts. 44. Here we go, Crystal. She Come turned her back. Car, Listen to what he's got to say. 25, 16. Double top for the match. Oh, the can't blame her for turning away. She was waiting for the roar of the crowd. It might just come in a moment because Whitlock, I think, 40. is dead and buried here. He can sense it, they can sense it.
everyone around here can sense it. This Darryl is Daryl Fitton for the match and a place in the quarterfinals. Darryl and he wants his favourite double, double top. Two to go. Yes! yes. Uh, it's all over. And the match! Daryl Fitton! A match we've seen. The fans here, Daryl Fitton. Everyone standing out there applauding. Two great players on that stage. But most of all, it's the man in black that's taken it. It was great, David. He flexed his muscles, and for once, Fitton was fabulous. Another Lakeside Classic. What an atmosphere out there. They know they've played their parts and they've seen something special on this Tuesday night. Yes, there was something special last year as well. With... Walking in a fitting wonderland. They're all Thank shouting. You, ladies and gentlemen. We'll quickly mention the figures here. Simon had a 30.75 average, 24 tons, 15 ton pluses, seven magic maximums. Daryl Fitton, 32.65 average, 32 tons, 15 ton pluses, nine magic maximums. That is why he's through to the quarterfinals. Daryl Fitton! What a match, what a fantastic match. Daryl, congratulations. Where does, this, where does that stand in terms of your performances down the years? Uh, one of my best. Uh, I didn't feel as though I played very well, actually, until um, I got in front. I was always chasing the game. And as soon as I got in front, I thought, I've got to keep it from My darts were going way high. And usually, we're practicing all day today, and I've been fantastic. I thought, I'm just like a time bomb waiting to explode. And uh, I'm getting there slowly. <laughs> when you got yourself back into the game and then edged ahead, we could just see the confidence growing in you. Yeah, that's what I'll need. I was chasing the game all the way from first set, I lost 3-0, I thought, oh, here we go. I won the next set 3-0, and, and then Simon took the next. I thought, oh, my God, he's going to go down to the wire, but um, don't give him a chance, you know. <laughs> when you put it all together, you have the talent to win this title. Yeah, just a bit, a bit worried about the inconsistency, you know. 11 darts and then losing next leg and then one leg near the end of the match. I was throwing the game because I thought I'd save it for the last leg. Uh, it worked out well in the end, but then Simon kept missing. So, oh, God, just... But I saved the last bit for the last leg. It was brilliant. So, Well, congratulations Thank you, Ray. to Cheers. the quarterfinals. Thanks, mate. Thanks well played. Thanks. And now Daryl Fitton's great mate is Tony O'Shea. Let's see his match with Edwin Max. Bravo, that's that. Well, could somebody get security or the police here? Somebody stole the water. Oh, it's Tarpey. From Lincolnshire, Tarquin, Ponsonby, Smythe.
Come on, hurry up, the bill's on. Get out the back and watch it. I can't hear you. I've got a disease that when somebody talks stupid, it turns off. Get it right, mate. Rich fat man, will you? Sorry? The difference is, you pay to get here. I'm being paid to act like an idiot. What's your excuse? They've always got long hair, haven't they, eh? Barbers died. Probably a wig. Probably a wig. Sorry? If you get, lose your hair like I lost mine, you'll have a great life. To the left, about three inches. Our next match, Wales versus Scotland. Who do the English want to win?
Martin. Martin. Ladies and gentlemen, 